Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel. Today I will be showing all of you how you can get long, luscious lashes within 5 minutes. And for this, you don't need an eyelash curler or anything fancy like that. All you need is your mascara. And you don't even need a high-end one. The one that I'm using is just a sample size from uh, by Benefit, which is high-end, but you don't need it for this tutorial. So I really hope that this helps you all, and yeah. Okay, so I am just going to start by coating my lashes, obviously. And I wouldn't really even say that I have long, long eyelashes. I think they're just in the middle. So this would definitely work for somebody who has shorter or longer lashes. And basically I'm just coating them as much as possible. The one thing that I always have to have on before I leave the house is mascara or I seriously feel like a guy. Okay, and what I do love about this coating method is that as the mascara dries and you keep putting more and more coats on, it gets thicker. It makes your eyelashes look even bigger and more beautiful. So yeah, you just keep going through them, and as, after I've applied a few layers, I like to focus more on the outer lashes, just because it gives it a nice winged effect, and I think it looks really good. It makes it a lot more dramatic, and yeah. And if you do it enough times, it even makes it look like you're wearing false lashes, which is awesome. So as you can see, I am getting those outer ones. And I feel like if you just hit your lashes straight on, you're definitely going to miss these end ones, which is a huge thing to make your lashes look so much bigger. I mean, a lot of people don't have dark lashes naturally, so if you make sure that you at least get all of them, it's going to make your lashes look so much more dramatic, so much faster. So as you can see, Mascara is drying a little bit, and before your eyes, it's getting longer, and focusing on the end ones. You can already tell the difference. It is ridiculous. And for some reason, whenever I use an eyelash curler, it always gives it effect that, I mean, obviously they're curling them, but it makes my lashes look so much shorter, which I don't like, obviously. So I'm not really sure what the hype about eyelash curlers are. Even though I do have one that I like to use sometimes, but definitely doesn't seem to be adding to the length any. So after I hit the end of the lashes, once I'm almost finished with the top, I just like to scan the top row and hit any of the end pieces that I missed. So I think that all of those are coated, so now I'm just going to move to the bottom row. I always do the bottom lashes too. Some people just skip out on it, but hey, the more the merrier, right? I also put several coats on my bottom ones.
Does it look like I'm wearing false lashes? Because I think it does. And a lot of people, what they like to do is roll their brush kind of on the inside of their lashes, on the top, on the opposite side, which I think is another great method. But if your mascara does clump up a lot, it's going to be kind of tough to straighten the lashes out. But if you do like the spidery effect, then that's also great. Now I'm just going to do the same thing that I did for the top and hit the very outside of my bottom lashes to make sure I didn't miss anything. So as you can see, these lashes look so much bigger than these ones. It is ridiculous. So I really, really hope that you got some use out of this tutorial. I mean, it's a huge difference. It looks like I don't even have eyelashes on this side. I'm just going to go ahead and finish off this side just to give you the full effect. Okay, and so here is the finished product. So as you can see, the method has definitely worked, and I promise that you can get this same result with any other mascara that you use, whether it is drugstore or high-end, because I've also done it. So really, just remember to put multiple layers on, and don't forget to get the end of the lashes, which so many people forget, and to also hit the outer lash as well on the top and the bottom if you like thick bottom lashes too. Alright, well I hope that this tutorial was useful in some way, and if you have a video response trying my technique, then please feel free to post it down below, and also don't forget to subscribe. Have a great day and week, guys. Bye!